Hi, in this video, so I'm going to show you how you can clean the pre filter on your Winix Zero Air purifier. You're supposed to do this every two weeks if you're using it often. So, to get to it, we just need to pull this front bit off. There's a magnetic clip here and here. So, just pull that towards you and it will come off. And you can see it's just held in with these two at the bottom here. So, put that to one side. And this is the filter we're going to be cleaning. So, if we loosen it from the top here with these little tabs and here and then it's also held in here and here. So if you just put a little bit of force in towards the middle, you will find that that will just pop out like so. Yeah, you can see it's just held in with two little tiny tabs there. And this side now, you can just pull towards you there. And again, it's held in at the bottom here with those two tabs. So this is the filter that you wanna clean. I'm just gonna pull those two out. And you wanna get a nice cloth or a vacuum cleaner and get rid of all the dust that's built up on here. Now, if yours has had a lot of use, you'll find there's a lot more dust than that. And then we need to put everything back together. So to begin with, we're gonna put the HEPA filter in, you can see that there's an arrow for airflow going that way, going into the machine. And now we've got our little carbon filter just here. And with this one, we're gonna be putting the tabs in at the bottom first, and these ridges are going in. These are the things that's holding against the carbon filter here. So we're gonna be putting it in this way, with these bits sticking out towards you, and just click them in, click them in, and just tap them in there and there. And then this gets located at the bottom. These two bits go into here and here. And just push that home. Just like that. So that's how to clean the pre-filter. Do that every two weeks and hopefully your air purifier will keep working well. Now if your pre-filter is heavily soiled, you can wash it. Be very gentle with it. And also do not put it back into the machine until it's fully dry so make sure you leave it a good day or so until it's fully dry before you put it in now it's in your best interest to wash out the pre-filter every 14 days because it prolongs the life of the other filters and they cost you money to replace while with this pre-filter it doesn't you can just clean it so it's definitely in your interest to keep it clean thanks for watching